Imagine being in a place where time slows down, where light cannot escape, and everything you know about the universe flips on its head. Welcome to the world of black holes and white holes. In the vast expanses of our universe, there exist celestial bodies so enigmatic they beggar belief. On one hand, we have the infamous black holes, cosmic entities known for their insatiable hunger. Their gravitational pull is so immense that nothing, not even light, the fastest entity known to us, can escape their clutches. These are places where gravity triumphs over all else, where the very fabric of space and time is distorted beyond recognition. But the universe is not just about black holes. Now let's flip the cosmic coin and dive into the lesser known yet equally fascinating concept of white holes. Theoretical entities, they are the mirror opposites of black holes. Just as nothing can escape a black hole, nothing can enter a white hole. Instead, they are the theorized exit doors, spewing out matter and light that were once trapped within the clutches of a black hole. Indeed, the existence of white holes remains purely theoretical, but the idea itself is a testament to the sheer unpredictability of the cosmos. It's a reminder that the universe is not just a collection of stars and galaxies, but a complex tapestry woven with the threads of space, time, matter, and energy. So, here we stand at the intersection of knowledge and mystery, grappling with the enigmas of black holes and white holes. They are two sides of the same cosmic coin, challenging our understanding of the universe, pushing the boundaries of our knowledge, and forever enticing us into the depths of the unknown. Black holes and white holes, two sides of the same cosmic coin, challenge our understanding of the universe. So, what makes a black hole? A black hole. To answer this, let's dive into the anatomy of a black hole. Picture a cosmic beast with three main components, the event horizon, the singularity, and the accretion disk. Imagine the event horizon as the black hole's mouth, a spherical boundary marking the point of no return. Anything that crosses this threshold, whether it's a spaceship, light, or even a rogue planet, is inexorably drawn towards the black hole's heart, the singularity. The event horizon is a one-way street with one destination only. It's like the ultimate roach motel. Everything checks in, but nothing checks out. Now, let's venture deeper into the black hole, to its heart, the singularity. This is where things get really strange. The singularity is an infinitely dense point in space where our understanding of physics breaks down. It's like trying to cram the entire Earth into a thimble. This extreme density creates a gravitational pull so powerful that nothing can escape. The singularity is the engine that powers the black hole, the epicenter of its gravitational might. Onto the third and final component, the accretion disk. Picture a cosmic whirlpool, a glowing disk of material swirling into the black hole. As matter spirals in towards the event horizon, it heats up, emitting copious amounts of radiation. This is the black hole's dinner plate, a buffet of cosmic debris that's been unlucky enough to get too close. It's this accretion disk that makes black holes visible to us, despite the fact that they themselves swallow light. So there you have it. A black hole is a cosmic beast with a one-way mouth, an infinitely dense heart, and a glowing dinner plate. It's an object so bizarre that it seems to defy our understanding of the universe, and yet, it's a fundamental part of it. A black hole, a cosmic abyss from which nothing escapes, is indeed a marvel of the universe. If black holes are cosmic vacuum cleaners, are white holes cosmic dust blowers? Let's dive into the theory of white holes. Imagine a cosmic entity, the polar opposite of a black hole. Instead of a gravitational monster that swallows everything that dares to venture too close, we have a celestial body that spews out matter and energy from which nothing can enter, but everything can escape. This, dear listeners, is the theoretical concept of a white hole. You might ask, well, where are these white holes then? That's a fantastic question. The truth is, we haven't observed a white hole yet. They remain, for the most part, a mathematical curiosity, a byproduct of the equations of general relativity. 
they exist in the realm of theoretical physics, a universe of mind-bending concepts and unproven hypotheses. But just because we haven't seen a white hole doesn't mean they don't exist. The universe is a vast place, full of surprises, in the same way that black holes were once just a theory. White holes could be lurking somewhere out there, waiting for us to discover them. Now here's where things get really interesting. Some scientists speculate that white holes could potentially explain the Big Bang, the event that gave birth to our universe. If a white hole can spit out matter and energy, could it not have spat out the entire universe? In addition, white holes could also account for certain unexplained cosmic phenomena. For example, gamma ray bursts, the most powerful explosions in the universe, could potentially be the result of a white hole's activity. But these are just theories, fascinating ideas that have yet to be proven. As we continue to explore the universe and push the boundaries of our knowledge, who knows what we might discover? White holes, the cosmic enigma, tantalize us with countless possibilities. Can black holes and white holes be two ends of a cosmic tunnel? Now, let's delve into the intriguing concept of wormholes, theoretical bridges through the fabric of space-time. Think of wormholes as cosmic shortcuts. Imagine folding a piece of paper in half with a dot at each end. Now, instead of traveling across the surface, you could just poke a hole and instantly connect the dots. This is the basic idea of a wormhole. In our cosmic context, a black hole and a white hole could theoretically be these two dots, with the wormhole as our cosmic shortcut. But what's the catch? Well, despite the tantalizing prospects, it's important to remember that wormholes remain purely within the realm of theoretical physics. Scientists haven't found any concrete evidence of their existence yet. They're fascinating predictions of Einstein's theory of general relativity, but so far, they are just that, predictions. Moreover, even if wormholes do exist, they might not be as useful as our science fiction fantasies would have us believe. They could be incredibly unstable, collapsing instantly without the presence of some unknown, exotic form of matter, or they could be so tiny at a quantum level that they're practically useless for any sort of meaningful travel. Yet, the allure of wormholes persists. They represent the ultimate bridge between the known and the unknown, between reality as we understand it, and the tantalizing possibilities that lie just beyond our grasp. They're a testament to our never-ending quest for knowledge, a symbol of the mysteries that still await us in the uncharted territories of the cosmos. So, can black holes and white holes be two ends of a cosmic tunnel? The answer, for now, remains veiled in the shadows of theoretical physics and our insatiable curiosity. But who knows what future discoveries might unveil? The universe is full of mysteries, and the connection between black holes and white holes is one of the most captivating ones. Are black holes and white holes the keys to understanding our universe? As we near the end of our cosmic journey, let's take a moment to reflect on what we've discovered so far. Black holes, these enigmatic entities of the cosmos, are regions of space-time where gravity is so strong that nothing, not even light, can escape their grasp. They are the ultimate cosmic vacuum cleaners, sucking in everything that ventures too close. But they are more than just celestial oddities. They challenge our understanding of physics, questioning the very fabric of our reality. On the flip side, we have white holes, theoretical opposites of black holes. Instead of consuming everything, they expel matter and energy like cosmic geysers. They're like a cosmic rewind button, taking the swallowed material of a black hole and spewing it out again. Yet, their existence remains purely theoretical, a tantalizing possibility in the vast cosmos. These cosmic phenomena, black holes and white holes, are not just fascinating celestial objects. They are key pieces in the cosmic puzzle, challenging our understanding of the universe and pushing the boundaries of scientific knowledge. They stand as testament to the mind-boggling complexity and beauty of our universe and our pursuit to understand it. The study of these cosmic phenomena is an ongoing journey. Scientists around the world are working tirelessly 
peering into the depths of the cosmos, seeking to unravel the mysteries of black holes and white holes. Each discovery, each observation, brings us one step closer to understanding the grand design of the cosmos. In this quest for understanding, black holes and white holes serve as cosmic signposts, guiding us towards new horizons of knowledge. They beckon us to venture further, to pierce the veil of the unknown, and to explore the final frontiers of our universe. As we delve deeper into the cosmic abyss of black holes and white holes, we inch closer to unlocking the secrets of our enigmatic universe. Our journey is far from over. The cosmos awaits, full of mysteries yet to be discovered. So join us as we continue our voyage into the great cosmic unknown.